guys, so in today's video, I made a fidget vending machine. It's pretty cool, here's the inside. I'll explain how I made it at the end of the video, but it's, it actually works pretty well. I didn't really watch it off of a video, it's just I got a cereal box and just started doing it. So, basically I'm going to use my pea popper. Pea popper, peanut popper. And I'm gonna put it in. The thing is, you gotta put it, you have to like squeeze the strip part on the, like to the, the side of the box, and you gotta keep it like that. So, switch it real. And then you gotta put it down. So basically, it fell. Let me prop my camera angle a little bit better. Okay, this should be pretty good. So, I have to wrap it up. I'm, I'm using my left hand. No, yeah, I'm using my left hand to hold it, so. So here, you, and you. Okay, and then the pea popper fell down. I'm gonna do it again, because I think it was rigged, because I was holding it up. But this time I'm gonna do it with my simple dimple. You didn't see it fall down. So yeah, and I also got two new poppets today. Okay, so I have this duck. It's really cool. I got this at like a store near me for like five bucks. Sorry for the background music. But there's a duck. It's a duck. It's cute. And then I have this. This is like my favorite pocket. Okay, so it's really cute. That is it for today's quick little mini video, just a toy machine. And yes, so how I made it is I took the box. There's little flips at the top. I cut it. I cut the flips off, and then I poked a hole through it, and then I just traced the square. And jeez, it's very really hard to locate myself. So, and then I made a little square. It wasn't like this before, but we had to fit this giant quarter because I'll, I'll explain why I have a giant quarter. We had to cut this, and then basically I just went somewhere, and then I took it with me, and then I it was like up to here, so I cut it a little bit, and then I used the piece that I cut it with right here. If you kind of if I, if you could see, I still use the box like right there. That's what I used, and. And then I took that part, I had to throw it away because I cut it too long. One too short and then I threw another one away. And then I made this one and it's perfect. And you have to take both sides, so this is the top. And then you have to take the bottom part down. You can only tape it to the one side, which is the back of it, which is this side. You can't tape it this side because, I mean you could, but the fidget would fall the wrong way. So that wouldn't really be the best idea. So I taped it, and then I made this part, the drawing, fidget toy machine. Sorry if I spelled the wrong word. Anyways, so that's what I did. <laughs> so, and then I basically, my mom cut it a little more like that, so it could actually put the quarter in. And then you have your machine, so I'm gonna try and use a wacky track. My god. Okay, you gotta really prop it up. And then when you're ready to drop it in, it should just drop like so. 
So if you like today's video, like it, subscribe. Leave a comment down below, please, can you subscribe? Because then I can do a giveaway when we're at, I think, like 25 or something. But, yeah, that is it. See you for now. Bye.